I think the same advice that I would give to any young people that is going to get to this profession. Uh, just try to be passionate and love what you do and that's uh, going to guarantee that you're going to be successful. You just have to love what you do and prove everybody that you can do it. Uh, especially for women, I would say that yes, it is difficult, but uh, women have been fighting through this for years and years and uh, um, where we are is a lot better than where we have been um, 10, 20 years ago. Uh, so just try to continue doing the good work that you are doing and uh, um, pave the road for other young engineers and women that are going to lead into this. But over the years, the difference between male and female is just fading away. So women are doing a good job out there. All you need to do is show your passion and respect of what people around you say. I guess if you have the passion and you have the drive, you can get where you want to be. And even if you have some criticisms on, along the way that might challenge you to get motivated, just say push hard and you will get there eventually. If one individual can do it, I guess everybody can. You just need the right support and passion to get going, irrespective of whether male or female, I guess we're all blessed with knowledge and it's passion and hard work that makes the difference. Okay, don't be afraid to take that step because you are going to be hum oh, how could I say this? When you're going in as a woman in a conference room, it's just 20 men over there, you know you have done something right because you are there and it doesn't depend on whether you are a woman or you are a man. It's your knowledge. That's why you are there. So I don't think about it as a man thing or a woman thing. I know it's a lot of men in this world, in this area for automation, but it's completely diverse if you see in the nursing, in the hospital, there's a lot of women there and the men are fewer. So it's depending on what area you are. So when you enter a conference room with this kind of knowledge, you know you are on a high standard. It's your knowledge that is the base, not that you are a man or a woman.